Hey everybody, welcome back to Comics Talk. As promised, I'm putting up a review of Netflix's latest series, The Defenders. Four heroes, eight episodes, all action. It is extremely well done. Um, it was good when I was at the halfway mark, episode four. Then by the time I got to the end of episode eight, I was like, dang. Um, just extremely well done. The characters come together easily. I mean, basically the way that the Avengers did for no character takes the spotlight. They all have equal face time. Everything's well done. There were some slower moments that focused on the characters. That's great. There was plenty of action. So it was an even balance. Um, like I said earlier, um, old villains return, new ones arise, and it ends on a freaking cliffhanger for one of the series. And I will not tell you which one. I have to find that out to self. But uh, there were some developments with some of the characters, um, some of the supporting characters, and... Um, yeah, it was just extremely well done. Probably the best Netflix Marvel series yet since they started way back when with Daredevil. Um, so now it's over with eight episodes. I mean, it's still on Netflix. Anyways, so I guess all that's left to do is for me to wait around for the Punisher series with John Berthold. That looks like it's going to be good. But yeah, um... Try to figure out what all I can say about this series um, without giving stuff away. Um, pretty much nothing that I haven't already said. It's amazing. I highly recommend it. So if you haven't seen it yet, go and watch it. If you need to catch up on anything before you get to it, go back and catch up on the other Marvel Netflix series. And a lot of stuff that happens with the Defenders will make sense. But yes, Marvel has dished out a good one, and I believe that this is probably the redemption from Iron Fist, which was poorly received, although I did like it. Um, but yeah, so good action, great villains. Um, okay, we'll say this. The Hand plays an important role. That's all I will say. Yeah, they've been given the Marvel Netflix percent crap since two thousand six. Um, they give Iron Fist crap all throughout his run on Netflix. So, yeah, awesome series. Um, if you like this, share, subscribe, turn to my channel for more comic book goodness. I'll probably have something else up later today. I just wanted to do this review of the defenders and it's awesome so three cheers for marvel's defenders or four one for each member um yeah so it's wonderful and i'm hoping that some of the story arcs um wrap up in the second season in the second or the whatever seasons some of the other netflix series um so, very good, very self-contained. Everything that needs to be wrapped up in this series was wrapped up, but still left cliffhangers for some of the other ser for each separate character. But yeah, so eight episodes and extremely well done. This is Fanboy X signing off, and I will see you later on Comic Talk.